National retailer pulled out of the Mondawmin Mall a few years ago. It really took its toll on West Baltimore. But today, as WMER2 News Jeff Hager reports, a new project on the site of the former Target store hopes for is providing hopes for the surrounding community. Tearing down the former Target store may seem like another step back for Mondawmin, but this signals a new beginning. What is going on here in this neighborhood is a prime example of the renaissance that is underway in Baltimore. And we just hope that those people who don't see it can begin to feel it and get on the train because I say every day, once the train is full, we will not be accepting any latecomers to Baltimore's renaissance. The Whiting Turner Contracting Company has managed some of the biggest and boldest construction projects in the country. And this revitalization project strikes close to home. The president and CEO of Whiting Turner, Tim Regan, personally purchased this property for a million dollars. It will take millions more to transform the old building and eight acre parcel into a community hub, which will be called the Village at Mondamin. And talks are underway to fill it with services critical to the area. Powerful neighborhood assets in primary health care access, workforce development and training, child care, Touchpoint is coming over here. Whiting Turner is going to have an office in here. And yes, some very fun and exciting food and retail opportunities. Hope restored for an area of the city known as the site where the 2015 riots began that can now envision a new beginning. When we talk about private-public partnerships and we talk about the opportunities uh, and the trajectory of our city of tomorrow, I don't think that you can pick a better community other than Mondawmin. Yeah. See, see, Tim Regan, again, he does it the hard way, his way, but it's always the right way. In West Baltimore, Jeff Hager, WMAR 2 News.